Alright, hey Josh here at a Columbia Company. As you probably know, it's uh, really cold and windy, but hey, 40 by 72, 16 feet tall. Now these overhead door openings right here, 14 by 12. Well, let's take a look at this. We'll go inside on this building. Kind of get an idea here. You can see here the light up the corners. Oh, there we go. But anyway. All right, you can see this porch right here. We ran it here, 72. We ran this, oh, what did we run this here? It's eight foot width here. And we ran this 48 feet on the side of the building here. Now, for to give you kind of an idea here, the windows right here, there's eight three by four windows here. All right, and then what we did, Obviously, the concrete still has to be poured on this, but let's go inside here. A little windy here. All right. All right, so inside here, boy, this thing is louder in here. But what we did here, you can see, we are actually gonna come back and put on the back 24 feet of this. You see how we did the scissor trusses right there? All right, so conventional trusses right there, two by six bottom top cord. And then again, drip stop again. 20 year warranty on that. It's got a fuzzy felt to it. Proof for animal confinement, easy to pressure wash. All right, and then you can see up here. So like right here, he's gonna actually, we're gonna come back. We're gonna put, this is gonna be a kid's room right here. You can see the scissor truss, scissor trusses right here. See how much headroom that's gonna give him. And then we're gonna partition this off. Uh, for his kids here, but you can see right here those windows up there four of those three by three So to kind of give you an idea so part storage part kind of a playroom for his kids And you can see we utilize three ply laminated columns for a building like this 40 by 72 I think that's applicable for the width of this building and There you go, and then like I said in, in the last video there's been a, really a hold on overhead doors. Um, if you get a standard door like a nine by eight, 10 by eight, those are easy to get, but the components, the supply chain issue, like those two that we're looking at right there, 14 by 12s, they don't hold up for that. So you can see we box this in a couple things, a couple details here. We box this in with two by sixes. All right, set up for a, a, a finish on the interior. Not gonna do it right now. Um, but you know, it's set up to do that if, if, if you want to do that or if the owner wants to do that in the future. All right. So give you an idea there. And then comments are always welcome until next one. Keep it locked and loaded right here. Attic lumber. Attic lumber since 1925.